Many of the cats at the Treehouse Humane Society ended up here after their families were unable to pay for their care. But while some people are giving up animals, others are stepping in to welcome them. Gaynor Henry came to the shelter looking to adopt. There's lots of animals looking for homes and they need a home and we can give them a good home. And generally these guys are more appreciative. While the organization hopes for adoptions, its goal is to prevent loving families from giving up their pets in the first place. We had a higher returns this year than we've ever had. Every time someone says, I can't do this in my home anymore and I have to give up the animal, you know, every time you do that, you're part of the problem. And you need to figure out a way, if you can, to rehome it outside of a shelter or, or work with behaviorally and, and do that. Treehouse offers counseling for owners in trouble and hosts weekly food drives to feed the animals. In the past year, the number of people using the services has doubled. We did get a call um, from a woman who um, was telling us that she couldn't afford the food anymore, and she said that by getting, you know, food from us, she might be able to <laughs> to, to continue to, to take care of her dog a little better. Due to a full house, the shelter is no longer accepting additional animals. Yet with many Chicagoans still struggling to make ends meet, it's uncertain if any of these cats will ever find a new home. Oh, so cute. Somebody will take you home. With a little luck, one of these shelter cats may soon find a new family. We'll have to talk to our other cat and see what he thinks. The food drives take place every Thursday, but treehouse workers say they'll accept donations anytime. Brooke Bowen, Medill News Service.